Welcome back to Arm Wrestle Simulator, where today I'm going to try to beat the entire game and the final boss in World 5 as a noob. If you guys saw my last video, then you'll know that this is my first ever time playing a simulator game in Roblox. And while well, we got to the third world and we made some good progress, as you can see, by our 44 trillion strength, but we still haven't been able to unlock the nuclear bunker. As you can see, we still have to get 5 trillion wins and defeat the final boss on this level. And so there's still a ton of things. I don't know about this game and I'm gonna do my absolute best to grind my way to the top to get to world five And we have some decent arms and some decent pets that we were able to gather in the last video But still I keep seeing a bunch of people running around in my lobbies with the most insane pets and we're only at a 360% rebirth boost so I think we're gonna go ahead and try to rebirth as much as we can and we're gonna skip on super rebirthing Because I don't want to start all the way from scratch and have to re-grind all of my wins That's definitely not something I want to do But maybe we'll do that later on for a different video So make sure you guys are subscribed to see that so let's see how far can we actually get we still have a ton of wins left Okay, supreme being that's not actually too bad 630% boost I will take it and now we are back to zero strength the lovely land of being absolutely super Per week. Okay, so let's chuck on our arm and uh, yeah, <laughs> it does make my character look a little weird, but it does give us a 400% boost. So let's see how much are we getting per hand strength. Oh, it's just not working. This is awesome. Oh my gosh, almost a billion strength per rep. And we're getting like 10 billion strength for our overall total. That's just pretty solid. Now, I really want to get some better pets. And I'm trying to decide if these eggs are worth it. We have 31 billion wins. And so we can open around 10 of these king fish eggs or two of these Poseidon eggs. And the odds aren't amazing. So we might come back to that a little bit later. As we're going to try for the king fish egg and we oh we get actually one legendary hooky which is pretty bad or hooky but we already have like eight of them so it's not an amazing upgrade but let's see can we craft some of these into bigs uh all right yeah that's some some pretty decent upgrades we get an extra like i don't know 10 percent boost on our hand strength all i know is that for the very final worlds we need quadrillions and quint Millions of strength to actually beat the bosses so we are so far away and uh still yet to get any diamond crates or diamond crate keys unfortunately but i think saving up for a good trail would probably be better than chancing it on one of those crates a few moments later okay let's see friendly shark oh wait that's a mistake 189 trillion okay that was uh not supposed to happen we're just about 100 times weaker than the shark so let's go trade up a little bit more before we try to grind some wins on him oh but i also also did just realize we have 500 frost eggs we can still hatch and i did splurge on the auto hatch and the 8x open so we should be able to breeze through them if we can get the 7500 x multiplier boost pet we would be absolutely chilling but let's see what we can get five minutes later okay after everything said and done oh we managed to get three frost jellyfish which they're now my number one best pet by honestly a landslide so that was huge opening up 500 of those it might be worth it for me to go back and start grinding those event eggs because pets are definitely the number one way i can easily beat this game and compared to some of the crazy pets out there we are super lacking in our pet department i mean there's pets out there with like a million multiplier and we're chilling with 600 1200 x as the max come on man we gotta do better than that but with our new pets equipped let's grind out some strength a little bit so we can rack up those wins big news ladies and gentlemen it's been a few days but that honestly helps me out so much because there's a new volcanic egg event and these multiple players for pets are absolute insanity five percent chance to get a 2000 x lava tiger if i show you guys my top pet my top pet is 1200 x so that would be insane and it's five percent chance i have 158 eggs and uh we're just gonna go ahead and run this event all day long i'm literally gonna complete this a thousand times try to do my best to open as many of these eggs as possible and then there's something i have in store to also speed it up a bit but let me run through all these eggs really quick and see if we can't get lucky getting some lava foxes which i believe even those are yeah whoa no wait 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 we got him 2000 what i didn't even see that 2000 x oh my gosh what do we do now what is auto train that was literally i know it was a billion before but that was a 2x weekend that was just 600 million we have now almost doubled our production and that was off of like 50 eggs oh my gosh this event's op oh another lava tiger let's go <gasps> no way the lava dragon epic isn't that like super duper rare point 
5% chance and it has a best friend five, which I think means it's as good as your best pet. But because it's literally my best pet, I don't think that does anything. No way. What about now? What about now? 1.8 billion. We went up four times. Get out of here, Braveheart. Dude, I'm going to beat the game in freaking no time. Oh my gosh. Now, I don't know if this will be smart, but what if I craft all? and equip best oh we actually went down some yeah oh wait that's without the dragon oh we went up just a little bit but we're not looking to get strength right now we're gonna go grind out like a thousand wins on this event but before we do that we're also going to get the double fighting strength which should help us out a lot not only in this realm but should help us out tremendously in every realm because now we defeat bosses twice as easily which means maybe can we actually try the friendly shark. We're just a few points lower. Oh, we can maybe get him. Something I've wanted to be getting for a while is the OP click. I have no clue if this is good. It could be a waste of 700 Robux, but we have to try it out. Turn it on. How many clicks per second? 12? That's insane. Why have I not been using that? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Wow. We just made huge leaps and bounds. And if we have this on, not only do we get 3 billion wins Every time we smack this guy, we also get an event egg, which once again is how we get all these OP insane pets. Okay, yeah, we are chilling. We're going to be out of this in no time. All right, we didn't get a thousand eggs, but we did get over 300, which means we should almost be guaranteed another lava dragon. And we also got two trillion wins. So really at this point, oh, wait, lava tiger, that's good with the, uh, with the wind thing. That's huge. Oh, we did get another lava dragon, but they don't even pop up when you get them. Oh, we just got another one. What the heck? We just got three. Dude, I knew this was the move. Bro, a fourth one. Oh my gosh. Let's freaking go. Yo, get out of here, lava tiger. Gotta make way for the fourth baby lava dragon. Let's go. All right, let's see. Kraken boss with OP auto click. Oh, we're, we're still getting absolutely annihilated. Jeez. And after some quick math, we should be able to defeat the final Kraken boss in just around 30 more minutes of training. And dude, I look so funny with my arms on, man. But I I need the arms for the strength. Come on. Oh, gamers, we've been grinding 1.1 quadrillion strength. We're slowly inching up this green bar. I'm probably gonna have to wait a minute for us to get this win, but I'm dying to see how many wins we're actually gonna get from defeating the Kraken boss. Oh, we're almost there. The Kraken boss is about to go down. 57 billion wins. Whoa. That was insane. All we have left to do is to get an extra 3.2 trillion wins and we can move on to the bunker. So to make this a little faster, we're just going to train up a, another probably three or 400 trillion strength and the Kraken boss will be no match for me. Not only did we have 5 trillion wins, we absolutely smashed through it hitting 6.8 trillion. Oh, let's go the nuclear bunker. Bro, I need 50 quintillion wins. And I'm 99% sure I'm not even going to be able to fight this guy. But let's give it a go with our OP. Oh my, wait, no, we actually got him. It's a glitch. We got him easy. 81 billion wins. Hazmat medium. Oh no, we're 100% losing to this fella. Yep, look at that. No, dude. Oh my, dude, we are making five times as, wait, no. Yeah, five times as much strength as we were before. And folks, I've been wanting to do this since the day I started playing this game. We have one diamond key, seven trillion wins. We're gonna go ahead and buy one diamond crate. Come on, give me something. That's, that's literally like the, no, it's like, it's not the worst arm. Second worst arm. We already had a 420% boost. So 545 is definitely helpful because that boosts our strength by an extra like 25%. I'm also curious to see just how good the rust eggs are. We get a Cal Raider Epic. I, oh, 10%. That's actually a really rare one. Oh my gosh, it's only 410x. These lava tigers are 2000x. Okay, so it's not even even slightly worth it for us to grind these eggs, which kind of sucks. But what is this? Cure pets. Oh, mutate. Oh, we get to combine two pets together? Okay, but like, what does this even do? I don't know what I just did. Glowing. He's glowing now. Okay. Successfully mutated. Okay. Glowing. Oh, did he just go up? I think he went up an extra like 20%. Can I even see him back there? They all look the same. When I tell you I've been grinding, 
I've been absolute grinding. I've gone ahead and got 21 lava dragon pets. I have enchanted all of them, or I guess upgraded all of them in that weird enchanter over there. We are now getting, with the big dumbbell, 1.2 trillion every two seconds. But I've also been grinding the brand new blueprints feature, and I just unlocked the 100,000th X huge quest dragon oh my gosh if i'm doing my math right these all have best friend five which i think makes them as good as your best pet by 75 percent so all these should turn into 7500 or 75,000 x multipliers and we should see this 1.2 trillion just done all this with this assumption okay six trillion that's 5x that's a lot okay it's not as much as i was thinking but can we go ahead unequip this and then also enchant oh we can enchant this i know we can disenchant I think so I'm not actually like screwing myself by any means I think this is like a 20% increase it's not amazing but once again with the best friends five yeah 20% increase go from six to seven point two there it is that's a six x increase in our strength oh my goodness i spent so long grinding that and i think we've just secured ourselves an easy path to beat mr bulk and then a super easy path to beat mr mutant king obviously you guys can probably tell i'm a little bit noobish because i haven't been doing this by the books i haven't really purchased any of these eggs even though i have six quadrillion and that's because i just kind of grinded out like unironically ten thousand of these event eggs that's how i was able to get all of these pets it took me around a day or so of just grinding the event non-stop we also got some pretty good huge lava tiger pets and upgraded enchanting some of them so yeah if you guys want to do what i did i basically just stayed on for a long time afk got my 62 tickets would go uh, spin the blueprint and after i basically got 250 of the green ones 500 of the blues and zero of the purple so this 240,000 x i'm just never getting it it's just not gonna happen ever and also i would really really love to get some diamond keys to get a better arm but i just don't really think it's worth for me at the moment oh buddy look at that mr bulk 185 qa strength versus 164 qa weekend so get it with our op auto clicker is that Oh my god, is that two quadrillion wins? Dude, I thought I just missaw that. Wait, wait, I also have a different strategy. I'll lose. I don't even care. What I did is I went ahead and made my teams. This team is for strength and this team is for wins as it gives me an extra 100% boost i believe uh over just regular so that was two quadrillion if i'm not mistaken this should be four quadrillion and we'll be zooming oh yeah oh yeah baby we're gonna be zooming our butts out of here in no freaking time i do want to see though how good those other eggs are because if we can get something miraculously better than a hundred and twenty thousand eggs which i saying that out loud i don't think that's gonna happen especially for 12 quadrillion but, but uh sure squeak sneak grime ravage we get Grime, 14% actually one of the rarer ones, and he's only 2,400. So literally, all of these eggs are just the biggest waste. Oh, what? We're getting updated in the middle of the recording. No, dude, my freaking strength boost. Just scuff. Oh, man. What I might actually do now that my strength got reset is just sit here and auto fight for quite some time, get a bunch of wins. One hour later. I mean, we have a ton of wins and we could definitely rebirth like 10 or so more times, but I don't even know if that's worth it. But I mean, if our strength just got reset, um, yeah, we're going to get like 100 quadrillion wins, maybe actually more. 250 quadrillion wins, I think is a good aiming point. We'll rebirth and then see without a boost how much strength we're getting every single time we curl our dumbbell. Okay, that really didn't take too long. Uh, we're up to 273 quadrillion. We're gonna go ahead and just spam rebirth. Ooh, that was an extra 200%. Now, listen, I'm really scared to super rebirth. I don't even wanna click this and show what it says. It basically removes like all of your world progress, everything. I don't wanna do that, but I will take an extra 200% strength increase. And so we just gotta grab this, train our biceps, JK, nope. go back. Make sure we equip the right stuff. And we're getting 4.6 trillion without any boost, meaning we should now get 9 trillion per curl after being on for a full two hours. Wait a second. I can actually do one better. I can cure this fella and then just keep going until I get the rainbow one because I think the rainbow one is an extra 10,000. Please. Oh, ghost would have been sick. Oh my god. No way. No way. 
I've actually mutated so many. There's no shot. This is actually, it's a 200, 200,000. What a brilliant idea. I'm a genius, dude. Okay, I feel like I've had pretty poor luck, but that right there, that 1% chance, the one percent chance. That is phenomenal. We just doubled our power, our strength with just the craziest one percent of all time. Bro, I can just see him at the top of my screen. He's looking menacing. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna focus up on our strength and hopefully in the not too distant future, the final boss will be going down. All right, so you guys remember when we had like a hundred quadrillion strength? Uh, yeah, we kind of AFK'd all night and we have 7.5 quintillion, which means this mutant king is gonna go down without a freaking fight i'm gonna see how slow i can click oh my gosh <laughs> The whole time I've been trying to absolutely just blast my way through all these bosses. And after weeks of grinding, we have now defeated the final boss. And we can just quickly auto fight him with our auto click OP because he gives an insane amount of wins. But again, with our win squad, we can actually make that about one quintillion wins, I think. Yeah, literally one more win and we've done it. We've gone from not knowing a single thing about this game to getting to the final world within the span of just a few weeks and maybe a few thousand Robux here and there. Oh, wait, it's 50 quintillion. I thought, I thought it was 5 million. Okay, never mind. I was pre prepping my big victory speech and uh, I, I got it wrong. Okay, give me a second. And a few minutes later, 50 quintillion wins. Get me out of the bunker. Oh my gosh. Is this heaven? Have I done it? Have I escaped to the afterlife? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I've never even seen footage of this. Bruh, you're gonna tell me I gotta fight a literal baby? If I can't beat this, oh my gosh, dude. I'm gonna smack him. Yo, baby man smacked. Dino, what are you doing, buddy? Dino buddy's getting smacked. What in the world? How many wins is that? I don't even know. I don't even understand. I'm gonna... Archaeologist getting smacked. What the heck? Why am I smacking everyone? 6.5 quintillion tribe leader. Tri oh, okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> tribe leader, he kind of did me dirty. How much do we get for auto training? I will say we did lose our 120% boost. And then what about the eggs? How much do you need for eggs? Oh my gosh, 150 quintillion. Alien. I mean, I have enough to open one of these easily. How much does a pterodactyl I give you? Oh my gosh, 40,000 X for the worst pet? Maybe these eggs are actually worth it. Wait, how much strength do I need for the mammoth boss? Oh my gosh, that's insane. We can go ahead and max out our trails though. So that should give us a little bit extra strength. Yeah, actually like an extra 25% strength. All right, and I did just come back to the bunker and I see three super OP people all using the big dumbbell method I was just using. I can't even find any dumbbells in here. I can only do pull-ups, but it seems like a terrible, terrible waste of my time. But let me see what kind of pets those 150 quintillion win eggs are packing. All right, 150 quintillion wins. I'm looking for a magic triceratops or a sorcerer T-Rex. Wizard stegosaurus, not bad. Let's see what that's gonna, 70,000. Oh my gosh, yeah, these eggs are actually pretty worth it. What I might do is just save up my wins for something like this. Because the best friend ability is super overpowered in this instance, so I just need... Oh, wait, no, I need a 200,000 X1. Ooh, that might be a little rough. All right, 560 quintillion wins. Let's... Ugh, it's the worst one. I need something good. 95,000 X is really good, but the only problem is I'll probably need, like, one of these ones to really make it worth it. And since it would take me, I don't know, another three weeks of AFKing every single day to get enough strength to beat this guy, I think our best bet is AFKing some wins for the time being and then crack and open some eggs. One eternity later. Hours and hours later, I think we have just enough to open three of these eggs we're gonna do. Wait, oh, need more pet storage. Come on, man. All right, now we should be chilling. Oh, dude, Jim Raptor, a legendary. I mean, that's sick, but it's 50%. We need one. Oh, no, dude. We just... One more chance. One more chance. Mr. Jim T-Rex. It's one and virtually never happening. Or we can get the Jim Triceratops. Three gym raptors in a row. That's amazing. You hate to see it. But they do have 120,000 multiplier each, which means if I was able to get a ghost on this, it would then make all of my other lava dragons a whole lot better. So I think we're just going to keep trying this over and over and maybe pull that magical 1% ghost spin. Well, we weren't able to get it, unfortunately, but we did get four rainbows. And by grinding those wins, we did get two diamond keys, which I know doesn't sound like a lot, and it really isn't. 
Uh, but we're gonna try if we can get a better arm. Seven, no, 700% would have been huge. If we can just get something over 600%, that would greatly help us out in defeating the final boss. Uh, another arm that I already have. Very cool. After full night of Ave King, we're left with 45 sextillion wins, and we already have a few dinos. I, I'm not gonna lie, when I first woke up, I couldn't help but actually go ahead and unlock some of these eggs, which is when I got this Void Gym Triceratops with a 280,000 multiplier. I went ahead and enchanted them or upgraded them to the Glowing Gym Triceratops for a 336,000 multiplier, but we still have a ton of eggs to rip through. I think we can go around 20. 12 eggs or so, but there's something I want to do beforehand, which is actually just get the all potions forever, because I realize I've been missing out on a ton of not only luck, but double wins as well. I mean, go and chuck on days worth of double wins, a bunch of luck, bunch of golden, bunch of voids, and so now we have the highest chance of getting something great, ah, uh, which, that's not great. We have a few more eggs. We need the gym triceratops. We actually, yes, we need, I believe it is, actually, that should be it. Just one more is all we needed, but if we can enchant that to a huge then we'll be chilling because now we have three. Oh, we have two voids can i get a third void one? Oh my gosh and a gym stegosaurus what the heck oh no i need gym triceratops gym triceratops no we're burning through we have like five more eggs left please what is up yes if that's a void, we are going to be so chilling oh wait no no can we combine these Oh my gosh, we can't. No way. No way! I was just doing this as a test, as a fun test. Oh my god, 560,000! That makes these obsolete. Okay, now I need to go grind that event again. I have just a few Robux left to literally 105 Robux left to my name. But if we can get, I believe it'll be, I don't know, like eight more of these lava dragons. Then they'll all be 405,000 multipliers due to their best friend five ability. Okay, yeah. That should be one of the final things we have to do in order to beat this game. We just have to go sit here and auto battle this guy for like a few years. No, no problem. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the time is finally here. After weeks and weeks of grinding, going from knowing absolutely nothing about this game to now going up against the final mammoth boss, we have a strength of 224 quintiles which should be absolute easy peasy work for this mammoth here 180 verse 224 oh my gosh we finally beat the game i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this little mini series don't forget to subscribe because i'm gonna have a ton of arm wrestle simulator videos dropping super soon on the channel and it just goes to show that with a little bit of grind and a whole lot of free time on your hands anyone can be arm wrestle simulator